everyone. In this video, we will be describing polynomial graph, and this is the first part. Before we jump into these two examples we have here, let's have a review on end behavior of polynomial functions. We remember that a graph of every polynomial function can be classified into four, even positive, even negative, odd positive, and odd negative. A graph of a polynomial function is even positive if the left end is directed up and then the right end is directed up. So if both left and right are directed upward. Now, a graph of a polynomial function is even negative if the left end is directed downward and the right end is directed downward. Now, a graph of a polynomial function is odd positive if the left end is directed downward and the right end is directed upward. And it's going to be called odd negative if the left end is directed upward and the right end is directed downward. Okay, going back to the two examples we have here, let's take the first one. What is the minimum degree of this polynomial graph? Now, please remember that the formula for minimum degree is minimum degree is equal to the number of turning points plus one. So when we say turning points, we are referring to these points. So these are what we call as the turning points. Now, um, in this formula, we are using the minimum degree. The reason why we have a minimum degree because in some cases there can be multiplicity, meaning there can be um, there can be more factors at a certain point. So when we say minimum, we don't consider multiplicity in this um, formula. So the minimum degree again is the number of turning points plus one. So in this problem right here, we have one, two, three, and four turning points. So then we can go ahead and write the minimum degree. Okay, so this polynomial that we have here is a fifth degree polynomial. Now, in the next question that we have here, is the graph even positive, even negative, odd positive, or odd negative? So as you can see here, since the left side is going up, and then the right side is going down. This is classified as odd negative. So I'm just gonna circle the odd negative here. Again, we had a review at the beginning of this um, video on how to determine if a graph is even positive, even negative, odd positive, or odd negative. At this time, I would encourage you to pause this video and try this problem out on your own. And when you're done, and pause it and check your answer. Okay, so we go over the problem here. What is the minimum degree? Again, the formula for um, minimum degree is number of turning points plus one. So we, we determine the number of turning points here. So that's one turning point, that's two and three. So there's three of them. Okay, since the left side of the graph is directed upward and then the right side is directed upward, both of them are directed upward, then we go ahead and say this is even positive. Did you get the same answers as this? Good, perfect. Now let's move on to the next example right here. At this time, I would encourage you to pause this video and try this problem out on your own. And when you're done, and pause it and check your answer. Okay, so we go over the problem here. Again, we determine the minimum degree. Please remember that the formula for minimum degree is the number of turning points plus one. So then we go ahead and determine the number of turning points here. That's one, two, three, and four. So that's gonna be four plus one. So I'm just gonna write the formula right here. Okay, so this graph is a fifth degree polynomial. Since we have uh, one, two, three, four, so there are four turning points, and then we add one to it to get the minimum degree, and that's the fifth degree then. Now, please, again, please remember that we are talking about the minimum degree because there are some cases that it has multiplicity, which means it has um, uh, it has more than 
two factors is at a certain point. So then we, we only, we're only looking for the minimum degree. Since the left side is directed downward, and then the, this side up here is directed upward, we go ahead and say that this graph right here is odd positive. Did you get the same answer as this? Yeah. Good, perfect. Now let's move on to the next one right here. So again, the formula to find for the minimum degree is, minimum degree is equal to the number of turning points plus one. So we count the number of turning points here. So that's one turning point. That's another turning point right there. That's another turning point. That's another turning point. And that's another turning point. So then we go ahead and count one, two, three, four, five. So there are five turning points. So we sh go ahead and show the work right here. Okay, so this is an example of a sixth degree polynomial. Since both the left end and the right end are directed downward, we go ahead and say that this graph right here is even negative. Did you get the same answers as this? Yeah. Good, perfect. If you find this video helpful, hit like and subscribe for more math videos. See ya!